Hey, what's up, you guys? I'm Travis, and this is Jack. What are we doing today? What's our video? <laughs> are we starting? Yeah. Hey, you guys, what's up? Wait, I'm saying hi. I'm saying hi. Damn it. Oh, I'm you told me hi. to start. <laughs> you <laughs> told me to start. <laughs> Get you threw me under the bus <laughs> in front of them all. <laughs> Get over here. Always fighting. Always. So this is gonna be the opposite to tracked video because me and Travis, we are similar in a lot of ways, but we're also very different and it's interesting to explore it because we're kind of, we're like opposites. Yeah. Because normally like the big question is always like, do opposites attract, you know what I mean? And I think we That's are- That's true. Opposites. We are opposites, For an example of how- out. Yes. They can work out. And so it's a good thing. And so today we're gonna be exploring some of those opposites. So let's get started. We were talking about this video, like when we were writing it out, it literally was like Chanel Walmart. Like, oh my that's gosh, no, stop, That's stop. what it is. It's no, it's so not like a better is... than or less than thing. It's like uh, just differences, just different ways of approaching things. So you when guys you guys be the judge. Yeah, actually, you guys be the judge and also comment below and let us know who you identify with more. Oh, that's I good. I feel like we have a lot of opposites, but I don't know. I love those things about you too. Oh, I wouldn't change stop. them, you know? Aw, uh, same, you. same. So the very first opposite that we have is Waking up in the morning. Yeah. L let's just say I'm always the first one to wake up in the morning. And yeah, Jack's- I'm, I'm the last to go to bed and the last to wake up. Yeah, Jack likes to stay up until the sun comes up. I own it and admit to it though, because yeah. like it's not like I'm like, no, I'm not that bad in the morning. I often describe myself as a troll under the bridge. That is accurate in the morning and you know it's accurate in the morning. Well, you just get quiet. Travis is always like, you look so cute when you wake up. And I'm like, that is a bold no, face you do lie. Look so cute. Okay, the next one is our eating habits because again, this is gonna be a Walmart <laughs> Chanel right here. <laughs> Chanel Walmart. Although, I mean, I don't eat perfect, but I think I do eat healthier than Jack. He eats vegetables, which I don't. I try and get vegetables into every meal, but Jack, oh. like every time Jack comes over, like I have to know that there's a few days after he comes over that I have to like recover from whatever I ate with him. All the garbage, <laughs> the pure sh we just eat fast out. food all the time. I can't help it. It's just there's fast food everywhere around oh, here. Wait. And I need it. Yeah. I crave it. I'm addicted. I crave it when I'm around Stage you. Stage an intervention. That's gonna be on our channel. Yeah, we're gonna have a fast food, food, fast food intervention. intervention. I like to work out. Jack doesn't like to work out. <laughs> like I'm a, and that's like well you don't hate it though, but I just like I really like to work out. I feel weird if I don't go every single day. I curse. Like I curse throughout all of the workout. Like I was working out on a bike the other day and it was just the worst experience. We learned this about each other when Jack came into town a couple months ago oh, and I took Jack story. to the gym to work out with me and about like 10 minutes into it, Jack just stops jumping rope and he just lies so down and takes a nap, took a on, nap the on the floor. floor. That, I'm, I'm dead serious. Jack is taking a nap as I'm finishing up the workout. It was too long, <laughs> I couldn't do it. I hadn't <laughs> done cardio in so long. It was 10, you, you stopped after 10 minutes. Does it look like I'm wearing a sports bra? Yeah, a little bit, yeah. Does it really? No, Why does it always no, happen? No, it Is it because my pecs fine. are so large? Fine. They look. You want to sit in my lap like you always do for all the other videos? I never sit on your lap. <laughs> Ow. Don't don't kick me. Don't kick. I can get my head like sucks. Yes, Travis. So for the next one, affectionate and not affectionate. Wait, are, is this the one where we're saying the dog and the cat? Yeah. So literally, in general. Travis, we've we've had this discussion where you're like a little puppy. I'm more like a dog, and Jack is more and like I'm a cat. And I'm the hated grumpy cat. No, you're not a grumpy cat. I am a grumpy cat. In the morning, I'm a grumpy I'm cat. I'm just like, I wake up in the morning, I'm like, hey, Jack, what do you want to do? Let's go do something fun. Let's go play. Come on, come on. And come. I'm like, and Jack's like, away into the shadows. I'm <laughs> Lucifer from Cinderella. You're not, no, you're not grumpy though. He just gets very quiet and not as enthusiastic as I am. I'm like very territorial and like, you need, I to, need like, to be away sometimes yeah. from like everything yeah the thing is with jack is like if you have him in your life you have to let him come to you <laughs> that is true let no, jack come true to you the, yeah i'm the one that's like hey play with me play with me here's all my love forever thank oh, you so stop. much for loving me no i don't no, want to be this way no i'm pitiful i don't want to be this way <laughs> change me why can't we just like mesh in and meet in the middle yeah that's well that's kind of what we do anyway yeah true the next thing that we are opposite over is Jack misses high school, and I do not. Nostalgic. You're yes. nostalgic. I'm very nostalgic. I like hold on to things. That's why moves are difficult for me. And I feel like they're oh, less difficult yeah. for me. Changes in general, I hate change. Yeah, I love change. Oh, I hate change. Like it is like my biggest fear. I hate everything about it. Again, it goes back to like puppy cat. Yeah. I'm like, Isn't I need the same thing. I need comfort. Yeah. I need routine. I, need to I don't even need routine. I just need the same yeah. over and over again. And when people change, I like go crazy. Yeah. 
See, for me, I moved around so much, so like moving around and change is like a new beginning. So you get like a brand new start, and you can like create a whole new life or a whole new situation. Can you do the Smeagol voice? Smeagol? Yeah. What is that? Oh, well, I don't know. I don't know. It's not the Smeagol voice for me. For me, it's called this little thing called Weibo. Weibo? Yeah. How does all this to move about politics to about this this morning? What? Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> I have no idea where this is. is this a cartoon? <laughs> no, I don't know. It's like some voice that I made up like 10 years ago. You made it up? Yeah. So it's... I just love how you're like, can you do the Weibo voice? Like, I know what you're talking about. Like, it, it had such an impact on pop so, culture. Okay, this is a problem that I have. Like, sometimes like I'll have like a series of thoughts in my mind, and I'll have like a full conversation, and then just like suddenly bring someone in halfway through the conversation. <laughs> <laughs> like what just happened? They're like, I have no idea what you're I talking had, about, yeah, Travis. I have no idea what you're talking about. <laughs> okay, haunted houses. I don't get scared, Travis. You get, I get you get super scared. scared. Horror movies. I hate haunted houses. I've always hated haunted houses because like horror movies I can deal with because at least it's on a screen, so I know it can't actually hurt me. But haunted houses, I always believe like I'm gonna be the one that walks in there. I get scared. I do get scared. get scared. I do get scared. <laughs> I scared. Because I really think there's gonna be someone in there, like a psychopath, that thought it'd be funny to get a chainsaw and come kill someone in there and they're gonna get me. I'm more of a city guy and this is more of a suburb guy. Yeah, I love the suburbs. I used to f*** all over the suburbs, but the suburbs, like, they're so nice, it's so remote, you can have like 10 children, have a minivan. Growing up, I always knew that I wanted to live in New York City. Like, I wanted to be in the middle of the city, always. When I was a kid, I aspired to be an actor. Okay, I would have been an actor. I would have been, like, I wanted to be famous, but I wanted to be a bus driver. Stop! <laughs> This is Chanel Walmart, the whole thing! <laughs> you'd be the cutest little bus driver I ever no. saw. No! You'd be the cutest little one. I would have stopped and picked you up when the kids were done with their route, and I would have been like, Travis, come on to my bus. I'd get on your bus. So this is the end of our Opposites Attract tag. So, so who do you relate to more, Walmart, Chanel? Are you a classy <laughs> bitch, Stop. or are you... Stop it. I don't know, what, what is the opposite of a classy bitch? Jack? Me? No. I guess? You're perfect. But yes, let us know who you guys relate to more. And then I guess that's all we have for this video. So remember, I'm Travis, and this is Jack. Oh, you say it though, don't you? I forget. You say I'm Jack. You say I'm Jack. And I'm Jack. And so that's all we have for this video, you guys. So remember, I'm Travis. And I'm Jack. And boyfriends or not, we got you back.